A Rio Rancho teen has made a remarkable find, something that's never been found before in the city, a meteorite. And how he found it is pretty remarkable, too. Here's News 13's Kim Baez. I saw a little black rock and I thought, that looks cool. Meet 13 year old Jansen Lyons, a self proclaimed meteorite buff. He was out looking for meteorites last September near his home using a metal detector his grandpa made when this caught his eye. I found it like this, so I went over to it and decided to try it with the detector, and it kind of overloaded it. This kid knows a lot about meteorites. He's flown through book after book on the subject. He was confident he had found one. I just looked at it. My throat was pumping with blood everywhere. <laughs> he urged his mom to have it tested, so mom promised at some point they would. More than seven months went by. Then, two weeks ago, they ended up at UNM. Well, we're always very skeptical. Dr. Carl A.G. says a lot of people bring a lot of rocks to them. Few are ever meteorites. A.G. says it is so rare to find a meteorite, even he hasn't found one. You can't just go out walking around and uh, hope to find a meteorite. It's, it's harder than finding a needle in a haystack. <laughs> Apparently, it is possible. After slicing the rock open, A.G. says he immediately knew this was the real thing. Tremendously exciting because um, it's not every day that uh, a 13-year-old boy uh, discovers a meteorite um, with a homemade metal detector. Dr. A.G. estimates a meteorite like this could sell for $1,000 to $2,000. Needless to say, Lyons is keeping his find in a safe place. Well, he may not sell this one, he does have plans. I'm hoping to find a lot more because I could um, make, uh, sell them and get more equipment and go out and search bigger areas. Kim Vias, KRQE News 13. Lyons isn't exactly saying where he found the meteorite because he plans to head back there to search. He does say it was in a very unlikely area. Dr. G estimates the rock is between 5,000 and 15,000 years old.